Hello, I'm Dr. Martha Radford, Chief Quality Officer for NYU Langone Medical Center in New York City. I'd like to share with you what we've learned from six years reviewing our numerator cases for all the Agency for Healthcare Research and Quality Patient Safety Indicators, the ARC PSIs. We've put in place pre-billing review by experienced quality nurses who have received special training in the ARC PSI analysis logic. Since we began our reviews in April 2012, we've reviewed 1,284 cases. Our constant and continued attention to coding accuracy means that we're confident that our ARC PSI rates accurately reflect our care and outcomes. The decrease in the rate that you see in the graph began before our systematic review since coding had already put in place their own internal review prior to sending the cases to us. We still find that consistently about 12% of the cases we review require recoding. The distribution of our numerator cases seen in this graph really reflects our hospital's case mix. We have a large orthopedic surgery service and we see a number of venous thromboembolism events in this high-risk group. We're a tertiary referral center and our accidental puncture and laceration rate reflects a referral population, often having had previous surgery that increases the risk. Risk of pressure injury to skin is highest in our frail elderly patients. Our extensive case review experience suggests certain changes to the ARC PSI analysis logic that would add clinical nuance and would render these measures more fair. For a variety of neurosurgery cases, prolonged intubation is clinically indicated, and these cases should be exempt from the post-op respiratory failure PSI, as should cases with significant chronic lung disease. The same is true for cardiothoracic procedures and the iatrogenic pneumothorax PSI, as well as for complications present on admission and the death after treatable surgical complications PSI. Quality of care for complications involves having in place prevention strategies and prompt recognition and treatment of the complication. 93% of our numerator cases received excellent quality of care. In fact, the only accidental puncture or laceration that resulted in significant patient harm was not even coded as a PSI. It was diagnosed after discharge. For all our coded cases, care and outcomes were excellent. Similarly, our assiduous VTE prophylaxis means that a preventable postoperative VTE event is rare indeed. To summarize, the ARC PSIs are used for national reporting, including hospital comparisons, since they rely on universally available coding and billing information for all hospitals. They highlight the distinction between safety monitoring and quality improvement, since only a small minority of these cases result from lapses in quality of care. Hospitals are well advised to assure that their care is accurately reflected in their hospital bills. Thank you.